In a world increasingly reliant on power and technology, cybersecurity challenges are rising. The power sector has become an attractive target for hackers, and with real-life attacks like those in Ukraine, it's a threat we must understand and mitigate. Imagine for a moment, a scenario where an industrial system is exploited, with a focus to overload the turbine or compromise of the entire OT systems with a malware, resulting in a power cut to the entire city. The first step can start with a simple phishing mail or social engineering attack. This is often achieved by phishing or exploiting one liabilities in software. Much like the Ukraine cyber attack, hackers can infiltrate the power company's IT systems first. Once in their plant malware designed to capture the credentials of operators. Armed with these credentials, the attackers escalate their privileges and compromise the operation technology systems that directly control the physical assets like our turbine. Using their deep understanding of industrial control systems, they could overload the turbine, forcing it to shut down. But how does this affect the power grid and the city it supplies? With the turbine compromised, substations that rely on its power face immediate effects. Substations which work on contact-based connections start to disconnect one by one. Once the OT systems controlling the substations are hacked, they can be remotely disconnected, causing a cascading power failure. Eventually, the entire power grid shuts down. The city is left in darkness. This simulation shows us the importance of robust cybersecurity in our power systems. By understanding these threats and how they work, we can develop more secure systems, minimizing the risk of a real-life attack. Through vigilance and resilience, we ensure that the lights stay on.